Okay, I'm gonna suck you too. Uh, <laughs> wow. Um, I don't know if anyone has experienced um, when the witch is riding you. Anyone ever have heard that term before? I was just, I uh, just had a discussion about it, right? And it's like, What is this? Because I noticed that um, this is happening to to many people. This witch riding them phenomenon, you know. Um, <clears throat> so far, I have experienced it firsthand times okay one was when I was a child it happened to my cousin um, we used to share a room with my mom right and she was on her bed I was on mine I think we was taking a nap or something and I awoke to her screaming something oh uh, the witch you know leave me alone you know when I woke up and I was looking at her you said what was going on I noticed that she couldn't move she was shaking she was trying to fight this thing off it's like she's just shaking, trying to move and get up, but she couldn't. She couldn't move. And I'm looking. I don't see anything there, but I hear her. She's, you know, she's frantic. She's trying to get this thing off of her. By then, I'm frightened. I don't know what the hell is going on. All I know is she's talking about a witch I ran and got my auntie and my auntie came in and you know she did what she could you know and eventually my cousin was free of that thing okay pushing up a few years now my little girl had the same experience when she was a baby about, she was probably about maybe two, about two and a half, maybe three. I awoke to her screaming and crying. And she, she was calling me in her sleep, Mommy, Mommy, the witch, the witch. I'm like, oh my God, because it took me right back to, you know, with my cousin. And, you know, I see my my little baby is just, you know, she's trying to fight whatever off, you know. She couldn't move. And she kept screaming for me and the witch, leave me alone, get the witch away from me or whatever, you know. I'm like, of course, I don't see anything, but I see, I know the routine already. I know she can't move. By then, I was very upset. I am a very protective mom, okay? <laughs> I will rip your ass to shreds, okay? I couldn't see this thing, but if I could, I swear to God, I would have ripped it to shreds. I yelled, I, I don't know, I just, I just yelled, you know? I was like, leave my fucking daughter alone, you know? And I guess the yell or whatever, you know? She, she woke up and she ran to me, you know? <sighs> but it's like, yo, what is this thing? Now, I, me personally, I've, I have, I have experienced some strange things in my dreams. But, not that. 
not where I I couldn't move or anything like that. You know, sometimes you have dreams when you're trying to run so fast to get away from something and you're moving in slow motion. You're really not going anywhere. It's like something is pulling you back. Now I've had that type of dream maybe once or twice. I've had a dream where a black cat, it, I was in space. I, I, um, when I don't see myself, in, when I'm in space around a bunch of stars and I don't see myself, okay, I know I'm astral traveling, okay? Okay, I'm in space and the dream starts off with these boxes that appear. They look like boxes. They come out of nowhere. They look like cubes. Cubes. That's the better word. And these cubes are like transparent. And from within these cubes comes a black cat. Now me personally, um, I've never been afraid of black cats. Uh, I don't fall it at superstition that black cats are bad or whatever because <laughs> that's a black cat. I'm a black woman. I have respect for black cats, okay? I think they're beautiful. When I look at a black cat, it takes me back to ancient Kemet or whatever. I see a collar on their neck, jewels, you know? Jewels around their neck and uh, on their little paws or whatever, you know? That's what I see when I look at black cats. I don't know about anybody else, but this black cat appeared. And it came. It, it sat on one of the cubes. It looked at me. It sat on one of the cubes. And then, it, you know, it, it, it stared off into space. And then it looked at me again. And then it was going back into uh, one of the cubes. It, like there was a pathway, like an opening between one of these cubes. And it wanted me to follow it. <laughs> now that was a strange dream, okay? I didn't follow it because, again, I, you know, I, I don't know where that was leading to. I, I tend to be cautious, <laughs> okay? So I don't know where that was leading to, but... My dreams are more like that. I've never had, <coughs> and don't want to, have a dream where some type of entity is, you know, on me or attacking me, you know? I don't know what this thing is that's going on. My daughter, my cousin, are not the only people that's, um, experiencing this 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 witch it's like what the hell is this you know what's going on and what does this mean because I've seen I've seen an, uh, another video on YouTube that the guy talking about he had the same experience it's like and I hear talk of it from others. So this is something that is real, that is happening. And I've witnessed it myself, okay, twice. It's, it's frightening when you look at it. I'm quite sure it's frightening for the people that it's happening to. But it's also a bit eerie and frightening looking at, you know, a loved one or, or, you know, someone that's experiencing this witch. And you see that there's nothing there, right? But it's, you can see that something is holding them down, you know? That's a bit eerie. Has, uh... <laughs> Anyone ever heard of this? The witches, the witches riding them. That's the, that's the, the term that's usually used because it's a witch, you know. 
Um, let me know if you all heard about this before or if it's happened to you. What do y'all think? Like, what is this about, you know? And why is it only happening to some people? You know, like I said, it, it hasn't happened to me. I've, I've witnessed that I've seen it happen to people who are close to me, but I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to talk about that and get your opinion. So, um, I gotta go. <laughs> y'all take care. Let me know what y'all think. Okay, bye.